getting rich at the flea market. This is how you get rich at the flea market. You find money. It is 5.19 in the morning. Welcome to the flashlight brigade party at the flea market. I couldn't sleep, woke up and thought, let's just go. So here I am. Another day to find treasure to see what people have brought to the market, what wares they are selling. Hopefully we'll find some, some good stuff that I can share with you all and just have fun with the hunt. So let's get out there, get my flashlight, see what treasures await us today. So we're gonna start off, I'm actually at Taco Stack spot. And, oh, what are those? Oh, cool. Crowder Jr. Jobbers. That's such a funny word. Those are fun um, notepads with the playmates or pinups on them. There's another one that was a little messed up though. Jobber. That's a fun jobber. Word of the day is jobber. There's some people that are set up. We'll take that one and that one. Um, but I figured I'd stop here first. I don't believe the tote man is going to be here today. Money receipts. I think he's away on vacation. So good for him. Bad for us. Good for him. What's this little guy? This has a tag of $6. Mason shoe dressing. To dress your shoes. Is this another one? Yeah, but does not the... We have some He-Man. Mo2. Condition's kind of rough. These are fun. I'm going to get to the bottom. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I'm going to break something. No one's at this guy's stand, so I might as well see what he has. He's in the tote man spot today, but that's all right. This whole box me. is Miami Dolphins. Oh. Huh. That's too big for me. That pillow's. Are they Miami Dolphins? <laughs> yeah, somebody did. Somebody did. Some old helmets. That might be original signature, who knows. How much you got on the shirt and sweatshirt? Oh, you have a bunch. Yeah. That's not too sure. That was a dolphin. Yeah, the helmets. <laughs> Even half pajamas. Oh, they're probably the rest. I'll get that. This guy goes in there. I don't know. <laughs> Any knives? Uh, knives? Yeah. Bought some dolphins. I have no idea um, if that was even worth it. I paid 12 bucks for everything. Uh, I know who Dan Marino is though. <laughs> uh, his prices are very reasonable. He's the guy that sometimes he brings like a bullhorn and he <laughs> he, he says the best stuff. Uh, but um, yeah, so vintage sweatshirt, which is really nice. The Dan Marino jersey and then a shirt that perhaps I can fit. Prices were all over the board. Again, I have no idea about sports, things like that, but. So Jimmy saved some Halloween for me. That's not. <laughs> we got a witch. No, oh, what's that? Is that like a giant pumpkin? Oh, that's fun. Scarecrow. 
that your best yeah. bike or not? Oh, he's so cute. Look at that little girl. Oh, she's adorable. Oh my gosh, that almost looks like the one from the Return to Oz. Oh, what's in the bottom? Oh, oh there's a costume. Oh, the skeleton. What's that? Oh my gosh, that's the devil one. That will go with the mask. Yeah, we'll see what he wants for this. He's really fun. Let's see what else he has. Oh, he's cute. Yuletide Enterprises. Oh, happy Smurf Day. I need that for my 80s party. I can wear it. McDonald's. These used to do really well. I think not so much anymore. Oh, he has a ghost. How oh, fun! He's cool. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a shoe. <laughs> Oh man, you're in the popcorn business today. All right, I need to put these things aside. Ooh, oh my gosh. They're still in there? Holy moly. That'd be funny to see what these look like. We're gonna do that, just as an experiment. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I told you Jimmy always comes through for me. Let's clown around, oh boy. Oh. We walked Disney on ice. That was fun. This has all sorts of things in it. Oh, Fred Flintstone? A bubble cereal? He's bringing out all this extra stuff. Oh my gosh, a Care Bear cup. I should get that for my friend Melissa. She'd probably like that. I'll grab that for her. I gotta finish looking through this box. I told you, Jimmy comes through for me. Someone commented that when I said Jimmy and the Tote Man, it sounds like a band. <laughs> That'd be fun. What if I made shirts? What would they look like? The drums could be like totes. Jimmy and the Tote Man. That would be a good name for a band. But yeah, Jimmy, uh, Halloween stuff, and a few other odds and ends. So, that was fun. So I'm a big, big spender. These cost me a dollar each. So we have this. It's a little flag from the Allentown Fair. I think they just put it on this pencil that's broken, but I don't care about that. Um, so I got that for a dollar, and then I got this great vintage cap for a dollar, and I thought this would be perfect to go with my Yellowstone outfit that I'm trying to put together. I think it has that 1920s, 1930s look, so we are slowly getting the ensemble together, but I don't come across a lot of Allentown Fair things like this that often, so that's a fun find for me. I don't know what it is in the world of reselling, but for me, it's good. Get some salt and pepper. Um, three dollars. With that five. Okay. I'll take it. Okay. That's my salt pepper. You do? Yes. Thank you. How much are your trees? These trees? Can I take some of this bubble, hun? Yeah, take the bubble. Those are the insides. 
No, 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 they're not. No. You're right, they're separate. This is the way they are. Yep, yep. These are really old. I and um, two of them have faces. They do not work. Oh, okay. Okay. And I do like them. You know, I think I'll do that. Okay. You want the same to look? I have more Christmas stuff too. Oh. <laughs> yeah. What Did you these? want the trees or yes, no? Yes, I do. Okay. Those are fun. These? I don't know what they're for though. Some lady <laughs> I bought them from her grandmother oh, like, made them. Oh. And they're old tops huh. from like some yeah, of them like are, That one has to touch, remove. I know. Aren't they cool? I'm yeah. like. I'm like. What so can cool. I use them? For? I know. <laughs> I don't even know. That's but why man. I bought them in the like, yeah, and I'm not crafty all of, like All that. of my projects, that's, I have how many of those? for the Viewmasters. Those are fun. Viewmasters are one of them. It's a bird trying around. I'm gonna grab those. I can't believe. Oh, that's from Bethlehem. Look at that. That's the Bethlehem Steel. There it is. Office building. Bethlehem Steel. I'm gonna grab that too. I can't believe you had a Ben Loves and Broomsticks book. That's like one of my top five Disney movies. Yeah. There's this dude. He's a chia, a chia pet. He's a head. I wonder. It's gotta be a chia head. We're gonna look him up just in case. The needle craft. This is fun. Well, I can see what remnants of things are in here. What's this guy? Libra. It's like a wooden uh, charm. What's this guy? We're gonna use a fine pet marker to sift through things. Oh, is that a ring? Nope, it's a little nut. Is that a penny? It is. 1948. Oh, look at this little pen. All these little things in here. Uh, it looks different. It's cute. That's what I'm saying. It looks like from the 1800s or something. <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. Especially, you know, you could tell from the color, like those movies they make, and it's all Golden those colors. Circle. You know, like brown or beige or something. <laughs> There's lots of pennies in here. Oh, that's a one cent one. Right, so we over, see how you doing. Uh, oh, that's stuff in there. Oh, what is that? <laughs> Cracker Jack. Oh, wow. <laughs> Getting rich at the flea market. This is how you get rich at the flea market. You find money in the box. Let's look in this one. Let's see what's in here. Weapons for peace? Martin Company. I don't know. Smack? Oh, it is! Awesome! That's cool. <laughs> it's a Mac yeah, ashtray. I saw, I saw. Cool. We missed that. <laughs> oh, well, what are you going to do? That's fun. Coat ray over steps. Oh geez, no, that's a little crusty and rusty. Oh gosh. This is no, that's damaged. Maybe it's stuck from something that's how old. Oh, what's this?
This is an older one. Oh, my pants. Oh, there's Mr. Peanut. Shit, you need a license plate? 1929. They're usually not the best, but I'll put them on the table. What about this guy? Those are right, those are on the bottom. Down here, please. this one from American Airlines. So I don't even think it's eight o'clock yet and the flea market there's a lot of people here but I'm I might go around once more to see what there is but I'm happy with what I purchased. So we started the day off with some dolphins. <laughs> uh, this will hopefully be the winning piece. It's a Dan Marino jersey. It's older so I think there's one up now online that's selling, that has a bid of at least 20 bucks. So I should make my money back by selling this. I also got the sweatshirt, which is really nice. And then the t-shirt, which I might wear. It's a little thin. I forget what they called. I don't think it's called thrash. I mean, you know, you can, I can see you in there, but it has, still has that fun vintage look to it. It might be a little big, that's okay. Um, so we got those. Then Jimmy saved the day with his Halloween stuff that he showed me and which I purchased. So thank you, Jimmy. A lot of fun uh, die cuts and then also the devil costume, which we'll go with. I have a devil kid's mask, so that's perfect. Then we bought an assortment of other little things. The cup for my friend, the Care Bear. She loves Care Bears. And then we got a happy Smurf Day button button which I can wear at my 80s uh, birthday party so a bunch of fun things from Jimmy oh and then also the the baby book which I'll take a look at all oh, that poor baby it's fun to see the decor inside the home which is great if you buy old photos take a look and see what they have hanging on their walls and how they decorate we also got the hat which will accompany me to Yellowstone. We may as well just do it now. Let's open this. This is the, oh, do I want to open it though? Maybe I'll keep it sealed because then you're always going to wonder what is it like inside? That's like sticky. I guess we're going to keep it sealed like that. <laughs> I wonder if this sells on eBay. <laughs> Uh, they cannot I mean they're not even shaking so they are they're they're probably stuck together um, and what else do we get the Allentown Fair little flag which I will keep for myself and then I ended up uh, buying some of the Christmas trees uh, the lady was nice you know she said two of them don't work but these are really fun you know the vintage musical trees they have the pipe cleaner or Chanel pipe cleaner decorations. And they're in nice shape. We got those and I think that's it. And then a whole bunch of little odds and ends from Taco Stacks. Uh, those boxes are really fun to dig through. You always miss things. Even if you are at an auction and you're looking through the boxes, you can bring home a box and there could be something that you did not know existed in the box. Um, but if you sell at the flea market, sometimes it's just easier to unload everything there instead of, you know, spending weeks looking through things, which is what I do. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this flea market video. It is a great day. I think this is going to be a great year, a great season for this flea market uh, between Jimmy and the Tote Man band, Taco Stacks, and all the other vendors that bring their wonderful treasures here. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm excited. Let's get ready to flea market. <laughs> it only works with let's get ready to rummage. You need a rummage sale to go to, to say that. But anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. If you are out looking for your treasure, I hope that you find it.